Hello everybody, my name is Jacob, and welcome back to Resident Evil Code Veronica X. So a couple of fun and interesting things uh, right now. Uh, first of which is the fact that, hold on, let me check my, oh, that's right, because I loaded the save. Need to put the ink ribbons back since I loaded the save. Um, it's been a minute since I, well, it's the next day. Uh, from me recording um, the previous uh, episodes. Um, I was going to record earlier in the day, but I shit you not, from 7 a.m. to like 6 p.m., they were doing construction outside on the pool of my apartment complex that happens to be right next door to the window uh, that's in my, th that like, the window of my room is, like, adjacent to it, so I couldn't record it all because you would just hear the the noise the whole time. You would just hear, like, sawing or, like, using some kind of a buzz saw or, like, some machine or something literally the entire time. And I just kind of kept waiting all day for them to um, stop, and they just never did. Um, it, it was maddening. At one point, so I couldn't record until now. It's like uh, 8:30 at night, and so I'm only just now recording because I had to make dinner and do all that stuff. Um, also, I was gonna say that I adjusted the um, color correction a little bit, so it's not as washed out. But now I want to adjust it a little bit more now that I'm actually in the game, because um, before I like was adjusting it based on being in that room. Um, and now I want to adjust it now that I'm outside. It looks like contrast is the, is the way to go, uh, compared to, uh, before, where I had it all cranked up all crazy. Okay, I like that. I, I'm okay with that. It's slightly blown out a little bit, but, oh, actually, now that I think about it, I hate that. Let me just... I'm sorry. I'm sorry I keep doing all of this for this. I honestly... Let's just put it back at where it was. There. That's fine. I can see everything better, but it's not horribly blown out. Um, I also, since I know that the Navy Proof won't fit in any of the doors and stuff in the, in the palace, and I don't have a key card to go and examine the rest of the rooms in the training facility... There's literally no other place for me to go but to come back here and go back to the other area where the submarine takes me. That's literally the only place that I can go right now. Unless I'm mistaken, but I don't think I am. Because then it would be like, oh, we'll go back to the opening area. But I don't think I need to go back there either. Um, I do... I will say, though, the more I play this, the more I do get missed vibes. I know I already said that with, like, the steering wheel... But this is just, like, the the aesthetic of these areas and just the way they're laid out gives me way closer to Mist vibes than Resident Evil vibes, and I kind of love that a little bit. Also, why would you have the loading screen pop up and then have, like, a little loading cutscene? What would be the point of the, of the loading screen, then? Wouldn't it be to hide that little loading cutscene? Hmm? Hmm? Wouldn't it be? Wouldn't it be? Wouldn't it be? Okay, it's square to shoot. I couldn't remember for a second what the actual shoot button was. I know it's R1 to to bring your weapon out, but I couldn't remember what shoot was. I am hurt, but I'm also not drastically hurt, and I only have the first aid spray right now, not the, um, no herbs. So I don't really want to, you know, fully heal myself right now. Um, I forget... Okay, I can go out both of these doors. I forget what's out through this door. Is it zombies? Oh, it's bats. Oh, it's bats. Oh, it's bats. I don't have the thing equipped. Equip. Yeah, stay back, bats. Stay back. Okay, there's this big light lit up thing. What's this do? This device powers the boarding lift. 
push the switch? Sure. Oh, this is where the Navy proof goes, doesn't it? Because it's got three little thingies. Apparently a control panel for the lift. Push the switch. Yeah, but it doesn't do anything because it doesn't have the th uh, three things in it. So I guess I have to find three Navy proofs? Or three different, like, maybe it's not Navy proofs. Maybe one's like a military proof and one's like an Air Force proof. I don't know why it's called Navy proof apart from the fact that there's a boat on it. So I'm just going with my going with my gut that it's um that it's all that they're all military based i was telling my little brother earlier today about like oh i'm playing this new resident evil game and has tank controls and he was like what are tank controls because so i'm like oh yeah you're younger you didn't have to deal with any tank controls in any games that you've played um and you know what oh are there are more bats here just run oh it's the same area it's just a further further down all right um and I'm like, that's right, you never had to deal with tank controls. Because your first system was like, well, was better. Um, and they didn't deal with that kind of bullshit. Um, it's control panel for the shutters. The marking above the keyhole reads K402. Okay, so find key K402. K-402. Oh, these elevators are everywhere in Resident Evil. Okay, lots of tur turned over, uh, a hastily turned over computer desk chair. That's never good. I'm just kind of wandering. I'm, I'm just exploring, because what else do I have to do? Con uh, control panel for the elevator iron bridge. The control lever is missing. Well, that's... How do you rip a, con a lever out of a thing? That's You gotta be pretty damn beefy to do that. That's not something that just any old person can do. Um, but I was like, yeah, tank controls. This is how they work. And he was like, that sounds disgusting. I'm like, yeah, it kind of is. It, it kind of feels like antithetical to everything else. There's a lever. Move the lever? Sure. Oh, is this... Yeah, but it's not there. Mm-hmm. I gotta play a fucking crane game. I cannot believe this shit. How precise does it want me to be? Oh, there's a shadow. That's good. Okay. Now, how perfectly precise do you want me to be? Is that fine? That better be fine, because it stopped itself. Oh, and it picked up both of them. Good. I didn't think it would pick up both of them. I thought I would just have to do it twice. Um, but, it, like, every everybody says stuff that's like, oh, you kids these days, you don't experience the burr 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 with the burr burr and all that sort of stuff. And, but there's a handful of things that I'm like, I think it's fine that kids these days didn't have to experience the control panel for the loading lift. A warning sign is visible. The lift may not operate if power levels are low. Move the lever. Oh, that's a zombo. I thought I heard some zombos. Really, camera? You don't. Oh, that's a lot of. Oh, oh, oh. Okay. Run, Claire, run. Okay, okay. Um. I really wish I could move a little further down, get the right camera angle. Okay. One down. He's getting back up. Okay, he seems like he's down permanently now. Just keep, just keep going, 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 just drop. Okay, everybody else is bleeding. It doesn't seem like anybody else is going to get back up. Um, now I should switch to the gun, though, because as we know, the bow does not like shooting down. Okay. I like that I'm now starting to learn that the bleeding out on the floor is a good indicator for when they're, like, dead dead. I'm glad that I'm starting to realize that. Um, I will take those. Take the bowgun arrows. 
And what's this flashy, shiny thing? Take the biohazard key! Oh, or biohazard card. That has to be for the training facility, right? That's gotta be what that's... I can't imagine what else it would be for if not for that. Okay, so we finally got the way to get through the training facility. So now we can leave and go back to the training facility. Go all the way back. Jesus Christ. There's so much backtracking, but I love it. I love it. I truly love it. Um, I mean, I honestly do. Like, my favorite parts of the remakes and the later games are when you're just given access to the one specific area and you're told, like, yeah, you just need to just loop around. Like, my favorite part of Resident Evil 2 is when you're in uh, the Raccoon City Police Department and you just have to loop around and around and around, like, reopening doors and finding keys and things like that. That's my favorite part. My favorite part of 3 was the hospital part, despite the fact that I don't like Carlos that much. It was just, like, having access to that one area and just looping around constantly. My favorite part of Seven was, I mean, the whole the whole damn game at the house, because that's all the house was, was just running around and finding keys and going back and unlocking. Like, that's my favorite part of Resident Evil. Um, it's why I'm kind of dreading Five and Six even more than normal, given their dubious quality, because they seem like games that just completely lack that uh, factor. But I shouldn't be too hard on 5, at least. 5, I've heard, is genuinely good. People are like, it's not amazing, but it's good. And you know what? That's I, I can accept that. Um, 6 is the one that I've heard is bad. Um, and Jay, I know you're watching this, which is ironic considering this is one of the few Resident Evil games you've not played. But uh, don't you forget, Jay, when, I, when it do, does come a time for me to play 6... I'm dragging you through that with me. You're, I'm, you're getting, you're going, going to get dragged through all that with me. Don't you worry. Um, because I got it on PS4 specifically for that reason, for that co-op. Because if there's any Resident Evil game with a co-op campaign that I'm going to make you play with me, it's the one that's supposed to be bad. Now, here's the question. Will this key card get me through both of those doors? Um, what the fuck? Um, sorry, we're a dune sandworm? Do I have to fight this now? I have to fight this now? Why do I have to fight this now? Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, what the f- Oh, don't you- Are you kidding me? Are you fucking kidding me? What- What the fuck? I had the thought as I was walking past with the key card of like, should I save? Should I save? No, I shouldn't save. It's fine. But, like, what the hell? Just a fucking sandworm out of nowhere? Like, I... Fuck... Ah! Alright. Guess I'm gonna fast... God, I'm fast-forwarding so much in this series. I'll see you in just a second. Be right back. Fuck this, fuck this, just run to the door, just run to the door. Open the door. Oh my god. Okay. So I guess I don't have to fight that thing right now. <sighs> Jesus Christ. Alright, does this work for the... When ventilation is complete. Okay. So, don't have to worry about that. Well, what about here? Card reader, it's electronically locked. Use the biohazard card. 
Do I keep the biohazard card? I guess I do. Okay. What's back here? Oh, well, that's... That's not comforting at all. The fuck is through here, then? Okay. What's my map show? Okay, that's a room ahead with a ladder. Okay. Don't like this. Oh, really, dude? You're here now, too? Come the fuck on! Just leave me alone! Oh my god. Alfred. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Do I have to shoot him? Is he gone? Motherfucker. He's gone. Okay, what is this? There's an indentation on the indigo blue plate. Okay. Motherfucker. It's locked from the other side. Well, of course it is. Oh my god, what the fuck? What's on the other side of this? Hello? Why is it so fucking intense? Is that two things of gun bullets? Gun bullets. You know, as opposed to the chocolate bullets that don't go in a gun. Okay. What is through here? They're playing up the creepiness factor so it's a safe. They were playing up the creepiness factor so much that I was legitimately... Oh my god, is this the medicine? Hemostatic medicine! Okay, I really don't want to leave here yet because I don't want to deal with that fucking worm again. So I'm going to put this medicine away. I'll grab these ribbons. Is it more than one or is it just one? Take the ink ribbon. It's three. Oh, thank God. I love that they always give you like three. They always, You always end the game with more than you need. And I'm okay with that, especially for someone like me where, like, if I'm going to stop recording, I need to make sure there is a save because it's not like I can just rely on an autosave or an anywhere save. T, Facility RR. So I'm always appreciative of more typewriter ribbons than I need. Okay, let me... Okay, let me just... Yeah, there we go. No, and it... Nope. Why does it constantly feel like this thing is moving faster than I need it to? Okay. Alright, I'm going to swap back to normal arrows, and I'm also going to load up the pistol. Still not fully healed, but that's okay. That's okay. Because we didn't get chomped at any point. And did I... Okay, now I'm on the second floor. I can only move through that other door. And I didn't go down below. I just came up. But this room... Oh. What the fuck? Welcome, Claire. Oh my god, this... Consider the area you are in a special playground I have prepared just for you. A special playground? Please try and keep me amused and do not disappoint me by dying too soon. I so want to enjoy this. I hate his voice a lot. Like, I know I already said it, but it's really... I know this series is notorious back in the day for having some terrible voice work, but like, Jesus Christ. All right, well, now that he said that, now I'm going to equip the bomb arrows. What the fuck could be through here? Is this the first sign of spiders? I swear to God, they're zooming in on that really close. I'm, like, covering my eyes because I don't know what's going to be in here.
Um. What the fuck? Okay. Submachine gun. It isn't loaded. Take the submachine gun. Sure. Well, I see some bullets down there. Mm-hmm. There's ammo for the submachine gun. Well. Oh, yo. What the fuck? What the fuck? Bombs. Bombs. Is he fully dead? I think he's fully dead. Okay. Good. I lost one bomb thing, but... I'm perfectly happy to have wasted one bomb thing if it meant he was killed instantly. It only took, like, three to kill him. Oh, they have 0% ammo, I was gonna say. I, it looked like they had 100%, even though they told me that they were out of ammo. Okay, anything back here of interest? Doesn't appear like it. Okay. Okay, another one. Cool. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Uh. Mr. Golden Guns. Is Claire, is Claire the hero of the game gonna get saved by this guy? By this absolute Jimmy Neutron voiced chump? Wow, I hate it. <laughs> oh yeah, that felt good. Oh yeah, that felt good. Don't worry, Claire. Your knight in shining armor is Oh here. my god, I hate him. I hate him so much. You wish. But thanks for the help. See? This is why you need me. I got your back. Whatever. Here. Take these. Machine guns for me? You know the deal. In exchange for your Lugers. <laughs> I mean, he did say okay, for something automatic. Okay. <laughs> You're taking the golden Lugers, cool. okay? Yes. Now this is my kind of weapon. All right. Huh? <laughs> hey. <laughs> <laughs> he <laughs> doesn't have any ammo in it. <laughs> up there. What a plenty douche. of ammo just for you. Way up there. Give me a boost and I'll get it for you. All right. All right. Yeah, way up there. Ow! My back! You're heavier than you look. I like they're doing this yeah. instead of him, like, awkwardly looking at her butt or something. Oh, there's something else up there. Happy now? Yeah, what? one clip for two guns. Oh. Now that your knight has made his appearance, he can join you in your descent into death. Did he say descent into dead or descent into death? Either one of those I like. Okay. Yeah, there's definitely something it. up on the other side. Wait here, Claire. Time to test out my new toy. <laughs> he sounds like a bad Sonic impersonator. Do not tell me I'm playing as him. Are you fucking kidding me? Why would I want to play as him? Why would I ever want to play as him? Yeah, well, he's bit now. Do I just kill all the zombies and then Claire comes back? Oh my god, I see a shotgun. I see a shotgun. Wait, he has a family photo? What the fuck? Family picture. Picture of Steve and his parents. Okay, I thought maybe for a second it would... Rockford Prisoner 267 Criminal. Okay, so he is a prisoner. He is a criminal. I thought for a second he was carrying around the photo of, like, the, um... The Redfield family, where he was like, Is this your brother? I thought he was carrying that photo around, and that was going to be real weird if that was the case. Um, what is that? Is that an item to pick up? That looks like an item to pick up. Oh yeah, it's... This cannot be used with a submachine gun. 
Okay, so I guess I'm not playing as him for long because I can't pick up that. I can't pick up those rounds to hold for later. So that's good. Maybe this is they're letting me have like a little fun killing spree moment with the submachine guns. So they're like, well, we gave them the submachine guns. We should give them a fun moment where they get to use them, even though we gave them back. Chemicals used for gun maintenance. This can't be used with a submachine gun. Well, fucking... Do I just go back? Just like, all the zombies are dead, Claire. You can come on out now. Was that really his entire thing? Not, not even... Um, not even Steve's entire thing. Was that really, uh, Alfred's entire thing? Just, like, six zombies? What the fuck? Wait, what, what, hold on! I killed everybody! Did I, like, from the young lady? Jesus. Card reader, indigo, and blue colors electronically locked. Okay. So, oh, there's another door here. I'm a dumbass. There's literally another door right here. Okay. So I go downstairs. Oh, I should have. The fuck was that? Oh, I'm blowing up chemical barrels. That's not great. Do I just go until my machine gun is out of ammo, or what's the deal here? This is definitely a change of pace, that's for sure. Caution, breaker may fail due to overload. In case of failure, raise the lever as illustrated. The ventilation device will resume operation. Okay. Sorry, is that a giant stone face? That was the worst thing I've ever heard anyone say in a video game. You see? This thing is a lot more reliable than any person. Than people? Oh my god, is he gonna get some emotional moment of, like, pathos? Steve. What were you doing here? Who brought you here, and where is your family? Shut up! I don't want to talk about it! Yeah, waste your bullets, why don't you? Steve. Never mind. Let's get going. It's kind of crazy watching this, how far we've come in terms of Resident Evil stories and like how much better they've gotten. Am I really not going to go back for the fucking shotgun? Are you really going to show me, me, a shotgun and go, no, 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 you, you, you don't get to go use that. just like ran away he was just like I don't want to talk about it me can I really not go back I must follow Steve but do you do we really need to though do we really need to Steve kind of sucks shit he, he's kind of the worst where the fuck are we Oh my god, are you kidding me? Are you serious right now? Oh my god, I get to play as Steve again, Claire, don't I? Are you okay? Steve, behind you! <laughs> uh, Steve? Why aren't you shooting him? Oh my god, is this like somebody he knows, or is this What's like his dad? Shoot him? Wait! I... 
I can't! I can't! No! Fucking shit! Well, okay, Claire! Pull out your gun! You have a pistol! Really, his dad. Also, he's really lighting him up when Claire is two centimeters away from him. It's just like, Claire, are you okay? Steve. She's riddled with bullets from just the spray of it. Is he really gonna faint? He's gonna fucking faint. Father. Father. Say it again. Father. One more time, please. We didn't hear it the first four times. <laughs> Dad. I used to work for Umbrella. I tried to steal information. I tended to sell it off to the highest bidder. I cannot believe. He was caught. Mom was killed. And we were sent here. Oh, Steve. He was a fool to do something so reckless. So stupid. You, and you know that this character made a huge impact on the franchise because he's returned in every single game since. It's okay now. Just rest. What are those th th things they have on their necks? They look like, they look almost like d explosive devices. Where the fuck am I? A changed father. Can I? Okay, I can't use that with those. Um, oh, I should. Whoops, hold on. Yeah, so where the hell am I? Okay, we're still in the facility. Okay, this is the door. Okay, this is one of the doors that I can only leave through. Um, what about... Oh, I'm gonna climb up here get these bullets that are conveniently hidden around the corner. Take the handgun bullets. Anything else, like, in the corners? A lift. The battery's been removed. Okay. Is this a door, or is this just a big wall? Large size relief. The imagery appears to be telling a legend. Well, thank you for telling me what the legend is, because I can definitely tell what it's supposed to be. Uh, let me try this toolbox. Nope, nothing. This is a door I can come in and out of. The other door I can only leave from. Oh, motherfucker. Fucking dogs. Dogs. Jesus Christ. Well, I'm going to have to use my first aid spray now. <sighs> At least I'm back to full. That's something. Yes, I'll take the bowgun arrows. Is this the other side? Big fucking tank. Okay. So what happens if I leave here? I really don't want to, because it's been a second since I saved, and if I run into the big worm... Yep, if I leave here, I will immediately run into the big worm. Cool, so we're not going to do that. back this other way. You've unlocked the door. Now I can move through it both ways. That's good to know. Hi, buddy. You gonna get back up? 
I hear your friend shuffling towards me. I'm just gonna grab this real quick. Are you dead now? Okay, you're dead now. Everybody's dead now. Card reader, indigo, blue in color. Do I use the key card with it? There's no need to use it now. Okay. Is that because I can just move through? It's because I can just move through there. Okay. Oh, there's two stories. To I was going to say, like, we definitely fell down. But no, there's two stories. You're on the first floor, go to which floor? Basement one. Because if that is a shotgun, I want the shotgun. Oh, but... I should probably go back to the save room, though. Um... Shotgun will probably definitely take up two slots in my inventory. And I'm not going to need the golden guns until I'm back in the palace. Oh, can I not... Can she not get through here because of the... Oh, no, she can. Okay. Never mind, then. I was going to say, like, maybe I can't get back through this way because of that gas. But, no, it's... We're... Made it through perfectly fine. Okay, not gonna pick those up. Can I use this? Can I use this? Card reader, indigo, blue, and colored. It's electronically locked. So I can't use the key card here. No need to use it now. Okay. So I came down here for fucking nothing. Except for these pistol bullets that I know are in here. Unless these are actually shotgun shells. In which case, well, fuck me, right? What is this? There's a handgun part placed on the work desk. It cannot be used with the M9, M93R. Well, shit. Okay. Chemicals used for gun maintenance. Chemicals used for gun maintenance. Can I not just pick the part up? What about the the loggers, the lugers? Cannot be used with the... Okay, I guess we're just only considering... Should I check it to see what kind of handgun it is? M93. Italian handgun, which is 9mm, 19 rounds. Cool. Okay. Alright, then. What about these? Can I grab these? Secure with a simple lock. I don't even have fucking lock-picking tools right now. I don't even know when you get lockpicking tools or how to get lockpicking tools. Maybe I missed them. I would have no way of knowing. Because this game is obtuse as hell, but that's just Resident Evil. That's not even this game in particular. That's just the whole damn franchise. It's just obtuse as hell. And I signed up for it, so I don't know why I'm complaining. Come on, walk up the steps. It's not that hard, Claire. It's really not that hard. Okay, so I'm pretty sure... What? Unless, what is this? I can't go down this. Okay, so that's not in a, a position to go. Take the handgun bullets? There were handgun bullets? Alright, sure. A weird looking... A relief of a weird looking face. Okay. So here's what I'm pretty sure I have to do. I'm pretty sure right now what I have to do is just book it for um, the, the uh, palace and put uh, the two loggers into the palace or, or those indentations in the palace. Um... Oh, I'm right there. So if I come out of here... I head all the way down this long hallway. Okay, I'm not where I thought I was. Not at all. 
this is a dead end hallway door. What's in here? Another safe room? Well, not necessarily a safe room, just a room with some typewriter. Is this one typewriter ribbon? That would actually be nice if that was just one typewriter ribbon. No, it's three of them. Cool. Well, now I can't fucking take the emblem, so I'm gonna have to save and then loop all the way the fuck around. I love it. I really love it. I could also just save using all three ink ribbons and just do that. That seems stupid to do, so I won't do that, but... Okay, let me examine... What's, what do we got here? Man's portrait is displayed here. Well, yeah, no shit. That's the blue relief that I need. Cool, so I'll have to go drop some stuff in the um, item box and then come all the way back here. Cool shit. I love it. Here's hoping that the second floor um, elevator can get me somewhere so I don't have to run right past the worm because I have a sneaking suspicion that I'm going to have to run right, right past the worm. And something tells me walking without rhythm will still attract this worm. Card reader, it's electronically locked. I cannot fucking believe this. I'm gonna have to go right past the fucking worm again. Okay. On the bright side, I did just save. So, that's something, I guess. That's <sighs> so annoying. Unless, and what I'm hoping is that it's just gone. Or, if it's not gone, I do have basically a straight shot to just run right past it. But then I have to run right fucking past it again to come back and get the blue shield. Then I have to run past it again! Fucking... Ugh! Okay. I'm not gonna stop the episode yet. We're gonna see if I walk past the worm. If I manage to make it past the worm, because if I do, then that'll be like a moment of triumph. Um, maybe I have to fight the worm right now. I don't know. I don't know. We're gonna find out. First things first. Yeah. Oh, no, wait. And also equip those. Duh. Alright, here goes nothing. You've unlocked the door. I'm gonna try to just run. But I don't know if that'll work. Let's see. Go, girly, go. There we go. We just ran. We just ran. And I think since since we now don't start with the um, cutscene every time, do I really have to do this every single time? I guess I do. Wow. Huh. Oh, no. The door's staying open. Huh. Who would have thunk? Now, the game is going to expect me to go put that shield in, but unfortunately I can't. Um, because I don't fucking have it. Oh, I straight up did not even, did not even realize that they were there. Okay, come on, come on, come on. Just, just, just. Stay down. Good doggy. Good doggy. Okay. What the fuck is back over here? Is this something? I can't tell if that's something or not. I guess it's not something. Let's see what's down here. Climb down the ladder. Sure, why not? We'll see what's down here before we call this an episode. Well, that's a lever. Breaker for the ventilation device is currently set to the on position. Okay. And I don't think I want to fuck with it. Okay. Card reader, indigo, blue in color. Well, fucking everything needs 800 cards, apparently. 
No, climb the... No, climb the ladder. God. PS2 complicatedness. You love it so much. You love it, you love it, you love it. I love it, you love it. We all love it. Okay, all right. And that's still locked. Yeah, all right, cool, cool. All righty. Um, to prevent me just, you know, looping back around the same area again, I'm going to go ahead and... Oh my god, you better... Okay, I was gonna say... I was gonna say, if that wasn't the case, we were gonna have words. Um, I'm gonna save... And then I'm gonna go grab that shield thing, and then come and then come he back here with it, um, and then start the next episode like me standing in front of that little podium to put the blue shield in, because I don't need to just run back there and then come on back. Like, just it's so convoluted and complicated that that's just that's just not necessary for anybody involved. It's really not. Um, I think that's best for everybody involved. So, yeah, I'm gonna do that, um, in between episodes, and then the next episode, we're gonna start with me standing in front of that little podium with the blue shield, putting the blue shield in, and seeing what sort of magic lies ahead for us. Um, yeah. So, on that note, put these away. Thank you, everybody, for watching. Like the video if you like the video. Share the video if you'd like to share the video. Subscribe if you'd like to as well. That would really help me out. I have been Jacob, and you have been wonderful. Thank you guys for, I mean, sticking with me and just sassy old Claire over there. You, don't you love to see a woman in power get shown up by a man with two machine guns that you gave him? Isn't that fun? It's so much fun. And this has been Resident Evil Code Veronica X. I'll catch you guys in the next episode. See you, Space Cowboys.